TV. All right, so like three or four years ago, it was a video that went viral, and it was supposedly Lil Baby and his 4PF crew jumping off set. And folks were talking about Offset got stripped up out his clothes and all that. Cause a lot of times when dice games get heated, ninjas start to rob him. And the word just got out that 42 Doug was there. And at that particular time, he ain't even pop yet. And a couple weeks ago, Wack 100 went on Clubhouse and said Offset went in 42 Doug's pocket. But according to 42 Doug, it didn't even go down like that. 42 Doug said if that was the case, he would have popped him. He wouldn't have had no other option. He said they snatched Offset chain after they surrounded him. 42 Doug caught wearing a Wack 100 store and got mad as hell about it. Wack 100 said if he wasn't there, 42 Doug and Offset then would have had a shootout. But Wack 100 claimed he grabbed 42 Doug and made Offset go back in the studio. I need everybody to listen to 42 Doug's side of the story and let me know what y'all think about it. Is Wack 100 lying or not? I wouldn't doubt it, but Offset said the best niggas do anything for clout. The only nigga. You telling me a nigga winning my man on my kids, a nigga ain't never winning my pocket. Why y'all turning niggas up? We ain't never heard about this shit from nobody. Why it start with me? <laughs> Why y'all think it right. start with me? These niggas ain't took no money, man. These niggas paid me to stop with them. Stop getting on these niggas' ass. Nigga, what you talking about, nigga? On both of my kids, nigga. Them niggas paid us to get off their ass. I, I was, was there. About, I was there. What I was there. What the fuck about, nigga? Turning these niggas up, nigga. Holy. It's the same thing I told the nigga Wack 100, man. These niggas. Nigga, you, you old lame. Turning these niggas up, nigga. You know these niggas ain't stepping like that, nigga. And I was by myself with 100,000. They tried me, bro. Right or wrong, they tried me. They surrounded me, told me, get. I, I ain't giving the rich niggas shit, nigga. And we, my mama can't die right now. We can't, we can't, we're me, you and Squeeze catch niggas that, dog. Got it. My mama. My mama could die if I'm lying, bro. I didn't get them niggas a dime, bro. And they end up was by myself, guy. Who you know Who you know doing that? Who you know leaving somewhere with a hundred thousand surrounded by 12 niggas with poles and leave out all this money, all the jury? Y'all ain't never seen a train come on missing a dude. What the y'all talking about? You nigga I ain't they ain't took shit from me, nigga. Them niggas, them niggas tried me. You niggas get tried. You feel me? Hey, I was, I was new today. Nigga tried me. I bet you they, I, I, bro, mm -hmm. bro. All type of shit doing today. Yeah. We made these niggas tap out, nigga. On, on what we catching, man, doggy, bro. Come on, man. We chase on elevators. Beat is all in mother. Indiana. Took niggas like, chains. Nigga. All type of shit. Like, what the fuck am I? I'm like nigga. Nigga, do I have to show this shit, nigga? <laughs> do I gotta show DMs when nigga trying to meet up with me in different cities? Yeah. I Saying, please that. stop. Please stop. I gotta block you. Oh, y'all. Y'all bragging on these niggas, acting like these niggas tough. These niggas got strip butt booty, man. <laughs> like a nigga going on a nigga, uh, a real street nigga pocket. Man, extra that. What the fuck? And ain't nobody that. Ain't nobody go down behind this shit. Dude got his pockets ran. A nigga swung, fired on dude, hit him in the And ain't nobody that behind this shit, bro. Right. My money. Ain't nobody. Come on, bro. You know we don't even play like that. We ain't never play like that. Uh, at least a tip, man. <laughs> Bare minimum. <laughs> Man, like, what? Bare minimum. In this ass nigga, he so much of a bitch. Nigga, you would you be somewhere saying this shit about nigga and, and money. You been with me. You know I ain't going money. You been with me, with me money. This nigga been with me, bro. This nigga been with me for years. He know I ain't going, bro. Money, you money. Know, like, he, he know like the whole, like, come on. Man, and I don't even know. But in my opinion, you sound like Doug ain't even playing at all. Somebody got stripped, somebody got their pocket checked, it sound like somebody playing the role. I'm just glad ain't nobody getting knocked off. And I'm a fan of them both. And I'm glad the law ain't have to get involved. It's sad because it's a really bad situation, but it could have been worse. If them guns had got the burst, somebody probably would have been riding in the back of a hurt and getting buried down up under the dirt. their family looking down on them crying and hurting. So I hope they learn from it because it ain't worth it. For two dudes said if Officer really would have went in his pockets, it would have been a murder. I had to make it look juicy for him. Trap to TV. Oh!